Hello farmers, welcome to No Nonsense Farming. In this video, we're going over a better, meaning better than my previous video farm for mass in the very awesome metroidvania called Grime. Before we jump into it, let me remind you to please subscribe to my channel if you find anything useful here. I am mostly on a metroidvania rush right now, so expect a lot of content like that. However, I don't shy away from a very good AAA title every now and then either. You are definitely going to want to get the gold growth armor set. It's very cheap and easy to get from the merchant in the world pillar. Max Ardor is going to get you more mass gains, so make sure you keep that maxed out as you're running the farm. The farming spot can be found on the Feaster Slayer in the Mauler Surrogate. That said, let's get right into the farm. Start heading to the left and take the path you see me take here in the video. You'll get to a point where it's time to start smashing enemies one or two at a time. So carry on and when you get to the two lurkers begging for that exploding ball to drop, relieve their stress and drop the ball so you can head back to rinse and repeat. It's important to keep Ardor at max to make the most out of the farm. It's also important to have the gold growth set. It's almost silly if you don't because you can do this farm for a bit to be able to afford it. So do yourself a favor and get it if you don't have it. Needless to say, this farm is way better than my previous farm for sure and in no nonsense fashion, if you were to farm this farm for an hour, you would end up making 116,352 mass points. So real quick on how we got to that number. Each farm iteration lasts around 50 seconds and yields 1,616 mass per run including loading times. Considering that each hour has 3600 seconds, if you divide 3600 by 50, you end up with 72 farm iterations. And if you multiply 1616 times 72, you get the magic number, which is again 116,352 mass for an hour's worth of farming. I hope you enjoyed the video and you were able to take something from it. This farm was shared with me in one of my recent Twitch streams by a fellow gamer, credit it in the description so I don't butcher his name, all of which I'm very grateful for because this is the kind of interaction I was hoping to create with this channel. Remember to follow me on Twitch, if I'm not editing a video, I'll be playing on stream and hanging out with anyone who wants to start a conversation. Stop by and say hi if you can, and remember to follow me there so you're notified whenever I start a stream. We're getting close to 60 subscribers. I really appreciate everyone who's supporting this project with me. And if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. It will help speed things up to generate more material for the channel for you to enjoy. That's it for me. Thank you for watching and see you in the next farm.